I'm at SEMA. Back over here. There's a great little Camaro back in here that's getting a ton of attention, as you can see. You can't even hardly get close to it. But look at look at that interior. And under the hood, equally as beautiful. Really nice little Camaro. And then we've got a big International Harvester, I believe. Yep. How are you? Very nicely done. And another great choice for a Resto Mod. This is big. Uh, it's called a Travel Hall. And here is the board on this one. 1970 Travel Hall. Boy, that's pretty. And uh, shop truck over here, all exposed engine bay and that patina that is so popular now on these trucks and exposed suspension and air ride down underneath here I don't know if you can see that or not and I don't think this is part of the builders competition but it's a race car sitting over here I wanted to get over here to this Buick Invicta, I think it is. Yes, the Buick Invicta. This is this car is getting so much attention here. One is it's it's huge. It's just a gigantically large car. But uh, an Invicta is a really interesting choice. Look at the interior on this. Look at that man of paint on this again. And one of the great features on all of these builders competition cars. But just a really, really beautiful looking car. So again, builders competition cars, they are almost as perfect as you can make them for what they are. Boy, that is really, that's really nice. And uh, let's see here, they got a board for this one too. Here. Moving on to another beautiful truck. I saw this one here the other day. Wow, this is just finished so nice. And another excellent choice for something like this with the uh, extended cab on it. Look at this interior. So, again, the attention to detail. Look at this back. Really. Beautiful, beautiful truck. I don't know where the board is for this one. They've got these boards set up with details on all of them, but I don't see this one. But uh, next we're going to take a look at this. Ford F100. The color on this is just really grabs your attention.
great color. with the builder's competition with this uh, Mercedes-Benz over here. And here is the board on this one. 87 or an 89 190E. Very, very nice. Saw this the other day. The Cherokee, just this gold paint is so nice. But another really interesting choice on a car for not only a restoration but modification. This Jeep Cherokee is gorgeous. And here's the board on it. Seventy-eight Cherokee Chief. And you see, it's getting plenty of attention. Boy, that is pretty. And we got a 240Z race car over here. I have no idea what's going on under the hood here, but it's pretty serious. I don't know if this is here for the builder's competition or not. It could be. It's in this section, so I'm assuming. And I think I showed you this car the other day, too. This International Scout. Another great choice. builders competition cars and trucks it's just you know the choice of the builder to pick whatever kind of car they want to compete with but uh, boy, I just thought this scout was an inspired inspired choice and then we've got one other car up on the stand up here another Jeep a Wagoneer and here's the board on this one and we got this up on the stand for viewing at every angle. Another great choice for a competition, building competition car. Really like that. Well, that that's what's here in the uh, builders competition section I don't think I missed anything <laughs> in this section um, and then I know I think I'd already mentioned this before but over here on the outskirts of the builders competition section the builders competition section over here on the outskirts they got a couple of cars like that black Mustang and like this but then I had mentioned over here too this is um, Matt Armstrong's Audi that he built to bring here hard work beats talent and Matt has proven that to be true he's got that not only on the doors but it's on the tires but this is is RS6 that he built. It's on his YouTube channel. And uh, I'm hoping that Matt's around here somewhere. I'm assuming he is. Haven't seen him yet. But uh, I'm going to stick around and see if I do. But anyways, there is his Audi RS6 from his YouTube channel that he built specifically to bring over here. Excuse me. I'm not going to 
That's a good looking car. It's got its it's got its flaws here and there, but uh, that's fun, and it was a fun story to watch on YouTube as well. So that is the um, the builders section with the cars that are competing here. Um, I think all of the cars are out here. Not 100% positive, but there there's what we got. So, anyways, that's the uh, battle of the builders section here at SEMA. Hope you like that too.